What is going on? I'm your host, Wap, and I hope you guys are having a good day, good morning, good night. Thank you for clicking on the video today's video. We are reacting to Flight's baby mama explaining her whole situation with Flight, her, and the baby included. Now, in Flight, in the Flight Reacts video that I reacted to, if you guys haven't watched that yet, please go watch that. It should be right here with the little eye thing of a bobber. In that video, Flight was saying, you know, Janet's crazy. You know, Janet is on demon timing and not the good kind either. She literally pulls up to his house, always stalking his location, beating up the girls he'd be hanging out with. But look though, you gotta, you gotta understand, okay? Flight never specifically said they were dating, okay? So there's no reason, there's no reasonable reason for Janet to be acting like this. Maybe Flight got it like those, I don't know. But we're gonna hop into the video, but before we do, they'll leave a like, hit subscribe, Let's get into it. In love with somebody, just loving somebody, you don't see what you're doing. You don't see your reactions till like you hit rock bottom. I want to apologize to you, Kamani. I know you're watching this. Welcome to the Drama Plug, where we get the hottest news and we love What's up, the Drama Plug? We got Soul Illuminati, DDG, and Kennedy. Can't forget Kelly Sweet, she's super pretty. Corey Vaughn, she wanted the baddest, you get me? Ashley Deshawn, her and her sister is hefty. Body like whatever, any weather. Let me stop talking, cause down the floor, this is better. Drama Club. Yo, what up, y'all? What's poppin', man? It's the Drama Club, man. And I'm back in the building. Drama Club. Aight? Make sure y'all subscribe to the latest drama channel on the tube. Drama Club. X. Baby mama okay, Janet. Now, for those of y'all who don't know what's going on between Flight Reacts and his baby mama, Flight dropped a video on her saying she was crazy. She used to pop up at his crib unannounced. She tried to drive him off the road. A yep. whole list of things he named. But like they say, it's always two sides to a story. That's and true. Janet just dropped her video telling her side of the story. Now I gotta be fair, I know I was trolling in the first video I did when Flight dropped his video because I seen this movie before. I seen it before with females and guys and girls trying to use them for clout and money. So I seen it before. So, and I spoke to Flight before. We had conversations before. He seemed like a cool dude, a cool guy. You know what I'm saying? He never really had no drama. So I was like, dang, it kind of took me by surprise. You know what I'm saying? So I had to, you know, I had to be a little biased in that video. But in this video, I'm gonna be fair. I'm not gonna take sides. I looked at the video a little bit and I understand what she's saying and I just wanted to bring it to my peoples on my platform at the same time. So with that being said, make sure y'all smash that like button and if you're not subscribed to the channel, make sure y'all subscribe with post notifications turned on. Please don't be disrespectful down in the comment section. I know I was trolling on her, but at the same time, people do have real feelings. She is having flight, baby. You feel what I'm saying? Flight is still her baby father. So there's no need true, for true, me true. or anybody else to be disrespecting her. She is trying to apologize, even though that's what he said she was going to do. But at the end of the day, everybody deserves a chance. So we're going to give her that chance. You know, hop on the platform, tell her side of the story, and give her honest opinion. We're not going to be biased. we just going to give our honest opinion to everything that she's saying. Now, she did a 40-minute video, or I should say 46-minute video. We're not looking at the whole 46-minute video. Not looking I'm going to put whole the 46. original link down below in the description so y'all can go watch it without my crying? commentary. But we're going to get straight to the main parts and dissect it like that. So with that being said, let's get right to these clips. Let's go. I want to apologize to you, Kamani. I know you're watching this. Um... Hello? Oh no, she crying. I'll take that back. And I'm not like emotional like that, y'all. I don't want you guys. Whew. I don't want you guys to um feel bad for me because at the end of the day, I'm just happy knowing that my daughter is, you know, coming soon. I'm just more so like how do I say it? I'm more so like hurt for my daughter. That's all. But other than that, anything else is like, 
you know, my my daughter is my biggest priority right now, so that's all that matters to me. Um, also, you know, just me, be, me and her, me and my daughter just having our family good and just in good terms, that's all that matters to me at this point. But let me take it back to Kamani. I'm sorry, and I want to apologize to you for everything that I've put you through. So let me explain what she's going through, because I know a lot of y'all young, and the ones that's not young is going to understand 100% what I'm about to say. When a female is pregnant, right, it's something called hormones. It okay. makes them go through different stages and different modes or how they feeling. They could okay. be acting crazy one day, then they could be acting super nice, super flirty, you know what I'm saying? Then the kind next like day, they so moody. Right. And I know the young ones don't know what I'm talking about, but that's what Google is for. I know make what you're talking about. Google and look it up. But besides that, her whole movement, her whole facial expression, everything about her tells me that she's still in love with flight. I'm not going to lie. I'm just calling it how I see it. Even look, though he's... Look, the thing is, though, look, a lot of times, you found saying, I'm young. You know what I'm saying? I'm 19 years old. And I've been with a couple girlfriends. You know what I'm saying? The thing is, though, I feel like some people, from my personal experience, some people... I feel like they get it mixed up with love and infatu uh, infat being infatuated with somebody. You know what I'm saying? Infatuation. Now, it's 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 hard to decipher which one is which because they both are very similar. They both collide in the same realm. But I think the more you the more time you spend with that person and the more you actually try to understand them, that's when you can decide if you're really in love with them. Or you're really just infatuated with the idea of having them as a partner. You get what I'm saying? I think, I don't know if you guys really understand what I'm saying. Like how he was saying, I don't know if his fans understand what the term of hormones is during pregnancy and stuff like that. But I can't admit that in my first relationship, I was infatuated with the person. You know what I'm saying? I like the idea of having them around. I can't say that specifically for Janet, but that's kind of what I feel like. And I may be kind of biased because I fuck with Flight. But I don't know. You feel what I'm saying? I just know the pretty ones. Like like Juice World said. What did he say? He said, um, what was that Juice World line? If you guys know it, comment it down below. But said that he not ready for a relationship or he told her that he don't want a relationship and she agreed. Maybe at that moment when he said that, she agreed. But after getting pregnant and about to have a baby by this dude, she definitely caught feelings. But let's continue and let's see what else she that, got. That, that's quite typical. Go. Y'all, y'all gotta understand I'm pregnant. So regardless, I'm emotional. But don't, like I said, don't feel bad for me. I'm good. But it's just like certain topics. It's like, goddamn, like, here goes pregnant Janet. But Kamani, I feel like I'm sorry again to you and I owe most for the most part my apologies to you and you only and that's because you know it's a lot of things that have gone behind cameras that people don't know about and I feel like I should have taken things to like in a different route and be the smarter and bigger person and instead of being petty and trying to get back at you and you know trying to make you like get Suffer. out of your character if I should say um, I feel like I must admit I changed a lot and I feel like it's not only in a good way but in a bad way um, I can admit that I uh, I'm not <laughs> going front I'm a hold up yo DJ bro why, why'd you cut her off like those hey, it be like that sometimes keep it 100 with y'all I gotta respect her. I gotta give her her respect for admitting her wrongs. You know what I'm saying? That she takes a level of maturity. You know, she admitted that she changed for the worse. Now, a lot of females would have been stubborn, wouldn't admit to their wrongdoings, would have always thought they was right about everything. Yes. So I gotta respect her on that. Yes, bro. sir. It's no one business but me and you at the end of the day. That's why I feel like I never should have came out and done a video just bashing you. Everybody knows, like... It, whoever knows me at heart knows that I'm not the type to bash nobody. I'm not the type to bring nobody down. No matter how how much people can hurt me, I feel like 
all that stuff just in the past of being like even petty towards somebody and trying to get them back i feel like this time i didn't really come to the internet and try to even do a video and getting you back or anything like that i just sucked it all in and let people you come got, to me you and this gotta and respect it but i may say that you me going on live that. and trying to bring up the situation and just try to make fun of it and you know try to say that um that you know you're just maybe the things i said on on live whoever saw it you I, you probably seen it come on you like i should have never said the things i said i should have never tried to even make fun of it i should have never just you know made fun of how you actually came off and and about your feelings because no matter what everybody has a heart and everybody you know has love for somebody at the end of the day and i understand that I y'all for the ones that don't know what she talking about, she went on live with her family members and her friend and she was discussing the situation between her and Flight and she was making fun of him, they was calling him a clown, etc, etc. But for those that seen the live, y'all could tell she was hurt in that live. She was hurt, she was in her feeling and if y'all didn't catch it, she said she loved him. So that goes to show you where all this is coming from. She and her feelings, she still love him. I think she want to be with him, even though they agree that they're not together or don't want a relationship right now. I think they're going to end up getting together because at the same time, they're having a child together. I mean, that's just my theory. But Hold on, look, DJ. I'm going to lay this flat out with you. Just because you have a child with a woman or just because, you know what I'm saying, a pregnancy happens, that does not mean... You got to be with that person because if you really feel like you can't stand that person, it's a no-go. The whole family will be discombobulated, okay? And I'm not saying I'm doing that personally because I want to be a dad. You feel what I'm saying? I want to, you know what I'm saying, have tons of crazy emotional moments with my children. But I'm only 19, so I can't really do that. You know what I'm saying? I got like 20, 10, 5. X amount of years left until I have a kid. But I don't really agree with what my guy DJ just said, but I'm gonna let it slide though. Anyway, let's keep it moving. I, like I said, I have changed a lot. My character, the way I move, the way I say things. Okay. You know, and that shouldn't have been how I should have went uh, about with things. And I feel like for one, like I Maturity, said- Maturity, you gotta love it. I didn't. Honestly, I didn't catch myself, you know, turning into this person that I that I'm not because you know I you when someone gets so caught up in themselves and being in love with somebody, just loving somebody, you don't see what you're doing, you don't see your reactions till like you hit rock bottom. Okay, that right there, I can atone for because personally, I've done some things. You feel I'm saying not not very bad things but i've done some really stupid and ignorant things and i don't really notice because i personally don't think i'm doing nothing wrong you know what i'm saying until a girl starts to point it out and then i reflect i'm like dang okay you're right you kind of exposed me there but you're right and i appreciate that because a real person that loves you they're going to expose the bad things you've done, but they're not going to critique you like that, though. They're going to help you so you don't make that mistake again. Come on, bro. Mr. Love whopping the... <laughs> with that person. So with that being said, like, honestly, I could say, like, I miss... <laughs> you can say, you can say. I put that thing aside. I do miss being the old Janet... Um, I miss being like, I y'all. Now that y'all seen that and heard that, man, scroll down to the comment section. Tell me what y'all think about this whole situation. I know y'all used to the, the drama, you know, the hype drama, you know, trolling and getting on people and stuff like that. But this ain't that type of video. This ain't that type of video, you know what I'm saying? I gotta give the benefit of the doubt. You feel what I'm saying? Especially when a person is admitting they wrongs, they're admitting what they did was wrong, you know, they're apologizing, they being truthful. I could tell when a person is being truthful or when yeah. a person is being fake. But with that being Keep said, being truthful. let's continue, man. I would call him out his name. I would just bash on him. Something that 
I never thought I would do. But at the same time, like, y'all gotta understand, like, how can I say this? Like, I'm I'm hurt. Like, I'm hurt by a lot of things from the past, and me being pregnant doesn't help. <laughs> I tried to take it all in, and it's like, you know, pregnancy is just a difference. Like, it's it's a bittersweet thing, you know? It's a good feeling, and at the same time, it's just like it eats you out sometimes that you just can't hold back. And I'm not putting the blame on my pregnancy, but it's just like, I'm a woman. We're hormonal. I'm not, like I said, putting the blame on it, but it's just like, I'm hurt, you know, about certain things. I'm still trying to make it work with that person. Still trying to love the person, but it's just like, the trust is just not there. All right, y'all. Now that y'all seen that and heard that, man. All right, y'all. What y'all think down below in the comment section. I'm going to tell y'all what I think real quick. Man, I think that Flight and Hush should just... Give it another try, man. Give it another try. Drama said give it another try. Feel what I'm saying? Because listen, man. Listen, man. I can see right through all this, right? She got real feelings for him, even though they said they wasn't going to be in a relationship. And I know he got feelings for her. You feel what I'm saying? Because in that whole video, you could tell he was hurt. So both of them is hurt. Well, yeah. Both of them probably damaged from past relationships. And I think either they should work it out or just work it out to the best of their ability for their child. You feel what I'm saying? Because the child gonna need the mother and the child gonna need the father. And relationships, they go through problems. You feel what I'm saying? <laughs> I'm sounding like therapist drama. I'm sorry, therapist man. I'm sorry, drama, man. Give me $100, man. We can set up a session, man. But with that being said, man, if y'all want to see this full video, man, go over to her channel, man. It's 46 minutes long. To All right, y'all. That's the end of the video, man. Look, my honest thoughts, I would say that I understand where Janet is coming from and I understand where Flight is coming from. Now, I mainly understand where Flight is coming from because number one, I am not pregnant. Number two, I'm not as hormonal as, you know, Janet is or women in general are. And number three, I rock with Flight. But I'm not using the last one as a main bias of the whole situation because I clearly understand where Janet is coming from. You know what I'm saying? I could. I, Something just inside of me is just saying like, she actually means what she says. And a lot of women, like DJ Drum said, they don't have the, the um, accountability to recognize the wrongs. They just gonna go with the flow and kind of, you know, blame it on the guy a little bit. And I've had that situation happen to me too. But honestly though, I understand both sides. Let me know which side you guys are on, Flight or Janet or both. I'm on both, so I'm, 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 you know, in the middle right now. But that's all for the video, man. I hope you guys did enjoy. If you did, leave a like, hit comment. But that's all for the video, guys. <clears throat> but that's all for the video, guys. I hope you guys did enjoy. If you did, scroll down below, hit that like button, and leave a comment on your thoughts on the video. The link to this video will be in the description, and also the link to the original video <laughs> will be in the description down below and also last thing last thing last thing last thing last thing last thing be sure to follow me on twitter instagram snapchat all that stuff should be in the square here i'm out peace out bye bye